The Kenton Medway Progression Federation brings together the three universities serving our area with both local authorities and about 40 partner schools with the aim of raising the aspirations and attainment of young people from the most disadvantaged backgrounds in our area. Students at KMPF schools really benefit from outreach activities by participating in a number of activities throughout their life cycle at school. Really to get the most out of the outreach activities, we feel that a good combination of aspirational confidence raising events as well as events that improve attainment in the classroom is, is the best combination for young people. All of the activities that we deliver to KMPF partner schools, we actually track through the HEAT database. The data has shown us that a combination of four or more activities increases participation into higher education or progression into further or higher education. Data also shows us that if students have come onto campus for an activity, they are more likely to progress onto further or higher education. It's a massive advantage to us that we're able to work with our colleagues in HEAT, that's the Higher Education Access Tracker, so that we are able to measure the progress of the young people. We're able to track their progress as they work with universities and college partners. We're able to see how they succeed. It's incredibly valuable for us to be a member of KMPF and to um, get the data from KMPF. Uh, first of all, the data is very valuable for me as the head because I use the data for Ofsted. The relationships we build up with our local universities are vital for us because most of our students will stay in Kent. But it's not just for A-level students. Our relationship with the KMPF is really strong um, in terms of Key Stage 3 students and lower down in the school where they have an experience quite early of, of university and what is on offer. Student ambassadors are involved in all of the outreach activities that we offer to schools uh, in support and in leading on events. You know, without them we couldn't do the outreach activities that we offer. I think the benefit of having student ambassadors involved in all the outreach activities is that the students have someone to ask questions of or to speak to who's that much more close to the actual environment and who is living as a current student and so has really relevant and up-to-date experience. I think too often we are too competitive with each other within higher education and I think as the years have gone on we do become more I don't probably guarded about what we do, but these kind of networks enable us to collaborate and share best practice. We end up reaching more people being able to do that. Some students come here and there is no expectation at all from them or their families that they will go to universities. By including them in these activities and by showing them that university isn't scary, that it is a place that they could enjoy, to see that they go home and then talk about it to mum and dad. And then when I see mum and dad at parents' evening, they say, oh, that trip is brilliant. Blah, blah, blah. And, and it just opens doors that would never have opened before. I've come from a family that's not particularly university oriented. I've never had anyone to tell me that it's not a scary place. And without the partnership between the universities and the school, I wouldn't have had that. And I began to figure out that to do what I want to do and to be able to enjoy what I want to do, I will have to go through university. The ability that the school's put in place for me to be able to do that, it's inexplicably valuable. We've been involved from the beginning with the National Education Opportunities Network and I have the privilege of being on the steering group for that organisation. We also were involved in the setup of the National Network for the Education of Care Leavers, which builds upon the work of our local Care Leavers Progression Partnership. Universities, schools, local authorities working together in this work really benefits the young people and we plan to keep going with this collaborative approach for as long as we possibly can.